get Nam the Kano sentenced and end killings in the Southeast now. Arawa Consultative Forum. Tell Justice Nyako. You people are not the one to get Nam the Kano sentenced. Hope you know that. You are not the one, and you cannot be the one to decide the fate of the people. Maybe you people have forgotten that Nnamdi Kano was handed over to the court. And it is the court that is going to decide his fate and not you the Northerners. It is now beginning to be clear when they said that Northerners are claiming to be the bona fide owner of Nigeria. Yes, you, you may be, you may be, but you are not the owner of the law. Do you understand? The way the law is applicable here in Nigeria, and so it is in other countries. All right? All right, let's quickly um, check the content and get it correctly. This is evening news. The Arawa Consultative Forum, ACF, has asked the federal government to take necessary action against the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra, Ipop Namdekano, and end his trial. Get Namdekano sentenced and end the killings in the Southeast. The Southeast geopolitical zone, especially Anambra State, has recorded a spate of violence resulting in killings and the destruction of properties. The police blame the attacks on the activities of IPOP and its militant outfit, Eastern Security Network, ESN. But IPOP has repeatedly denied involvement in the attacks in the zone. Last weekend, a woman identified as Hariaria Jubril and her four sons were killed by gunmen in Orumba, North local government area of Anambra. The deceased were from the northern part of the country. Reacting to the incident, Musa Seidu, chieftain of the ACF, in a statement on Saturday alleged that innocent people were equally murdered. Seidu, who is also the leader of Arewa community in South South and South East, asked the Anambra state government to compensate the family of Harera Jubril. The federal government must take necessary action against IPOP. The situation is getting out of hand. Many innocent people are being attacked daily by the group in the southeast, Nan quoted Seidu. In fact, we have documentary evidence on killings by IPOP across the southeast from 1992 to date, and most of the victims are our people. The security agencies are aware of this. We condemn in total the cold blood mother of Fatima Jubril and her four son, and we urge security agencies to go after the killers. The lady was killed without any provocation. We call on the Anambra government to pay compensation to her family and ensure that the killers are brought to book. The federal government must also take necessary actions against IPOP. The situation is getting out of hand. As such, immediate action must be taken to prevent reprisal. We commend Buari for the verbal condemnation, but this is not enough. We must take necessary action to stop reoccurring attacks on Nautilus by IPOPs. Arewa Consultative Forum is a Northern Forum. It's just like the Mieti Anla. You don't expect them to throw support 
for Biafran or, uh, or for Biafran freedom. So I am not surprised that uh, they are bringing up this kind of um, quest before the courts. You understand? It's, uh, it, it's not a surprise. It's not a surprise. You understand? So, um, but one thing that I must make them to understand is that uh, the quest for justice is not one-sided. It's not one-sided. The quest for justice is supposed to be a collective thing. You don't expect the court to be by the side of one person. That is partisanship. You don't expect the court to be partisan in nature. No. The courts can never be partisan. The courts must be in the middle, neutral, neutral. The court is not a political forum. Court is not a political forum. All right? So um, they need to get this correctly. They need to understand this. They need to know this and see that the importance of this is for themselves and for Nigeria itself. At least everybody is, is, is already seeing it clearly that Namdi Kano has been winning the trial. You know, he has pleaded not guilty of all count charges. So what are we saying? What are we saying? So, my dear people in the house, um, Arewa Consultative Forum must, first of all, uh, try to be neutral. Try to be neutral. You understand? Because it is not, it, things are not done in that way or in that manner. Things are not done in a, in a way that uh, only one person or one-sided uh, one, one, one person Will be, uh, will be will be supported. No, and that is one thing I must um, make Justice Binta Nyako to understand. She must not allow herself to be to be uh, to be pissed up or to be to be um, dangled around. You know, say okay. Nobody must impose impose uh, decision for her. She should uh, give a judgment based on what she has collated from day one when this very trial started. That is my own advice. You understand? And I just did. All right, my dear people in the house, based on these very facts, um, let me hear from you and know what your take and opinion on this broadcast may be. Don't forget to leave them below the comment section. Click on the subscription buttons as well as the bell buttons to get updated each time we upload any new videos. Thank you.